Daniel says, hey guys, there have been discussions regarding or su suggesting we use our Twitter channel as our main feed and set up a set of IFTTT recipes which post our tweets out to our all our Web 2.0 properties. Um, I don't know where that discussion came from, Daniel. Um, Daniel, um, are the Twitter recipes something additional to the standard RSS trigger rep recipes that we should be using? How exactly should we be using Twitter-based recipes in conjunction with a regular approach? Just trying to get an understanding or just trying to understand whether or not there have been any changes along these lines by you guys or if we stick with the same formula. Okay, Daniel, stick with the same formula. Um, IFTTT, SEO, the, the, the networks are for blog syndication or YouTube syndication. However, you can also use Twitter to syndicate tweets. I would, don't recommend, personally, I don't like to syndicate, um, to use my branded network for a Twitter syndication network. We, I build a second or supplementary network for the Twitter account and then have the Twitter tweets with using the uh, embed tweet recipes to post my tweets out to a supplemental network. That's all covered again in the Twitter SEO Academy. That's not something that is part of the IFTTT SEO training and there's a reason for that because it's, it's kind of a, it's a, it's a supplementary or an additional thing that you can do but it's not required. It will help you um, in various ways, bring trust flow, you know, increase trust flow and stuff like that. But again, all of the questions that you're asking here are covered inside of Twitter SEO Academy. Um, as far as the IFTTT approach, the, the stick with the training that we have and use your blog or your money, your, or excuse me, your YouTube channel as your syndication trigger for your branded network. I don't recommend that you use, that you feed your branded network with tweets because in my own opinion, we had this discussion. This exact question came up within the last two weeks in Hump Day Hangouts, and we talked about it. Personally, I don't like to have tweets embedded across my branded network. I like to use a supplementary network network for that. Okay. Um, I guess it depends. Uh, I, I think Marco chimed in on this the last time, and I think it was. Um, it depends on what kind of tweets. If you're in something that's got a lot of pictures and images and things like that, then it would be fine to do that because. The uh, image gets embedded as well with the tweet, but for you know a lot of stuff that I work in, a lot of the industries that I work in, um, it just doesn't really look right when I. So I set up a secondary network for Twitter syndication specifically that will basically syndicate the branded tier one Twitter account tweets to another network, and it just adds some additional juice. 